Sports is brought to you by Jim White Honda. Despite a record-setting 19-1 conference record last year, Toledo women's basketball was left out of the NCAA tournament. A travesty, really, in the eyes of many Rockets. And although Coach Cullop felt the same, she also used that decision as a wake-up call and wasted no time in beefing up her schedule. Our Tyler Segerman explains. This is the most ambitious schedule we've played to date. With four months until their season tips off, Toledo head coach Trisha Cullop announced today that her Rockets will be experiencing high-level competition come non-conference play. We don't want to leave any stone unturned. We want to make sure that not only are we preparing for the MAC by playing a tough schedule, but that we're proving to the selection committee that we deserve to be in this tournament. Last year, Toledo ranked below the top 100 when it came to strength of schedule. But that number should rise this winter. Here are the four teams that the Rockets have approved contracts with for the upcoming season. The big one, Duke, who will be coming to Savage Arena for the first time since 2001. Missouri State and Dayton, whom both played in the NCAA tournament back in March, will travel up to the Glass City as well. And a trip to Cincinnati, also on the docket for Toledo. Pressure is a privilege, and we want to make sure that we understand that there is a target on our back. Three quality games in front of a home crowd certainly gives Coach Cullip a reason to smile. This is an incredible atmosphere. We've been top 30 in the country in attendance nine out of the last 10 years. We've owned the MAC attendance record for 31 years. The dates and times for these matchups are still to be determined, with more opponents still to be announced. Guess who's still playing? For now, there's just one message to share. Get out and get your season tickets. We want to see you in the stands. We'd love to have an even higher average in, in Savage Arena this season.